Hello, hello everyone. Cheryl sure, Alena Herbert Walker. Welcome to my channel. I'm back with another video. I'm counting for real. Still working on these beats. So I like this beat right here. Still working on uh, trying to pick out a beat for my uh, upcoming song. So it's just a draft that, um, just a draft that, um, you know, my words for my next song, but I'm just trying to find a beat. I'm just trying to find the right beat, so I probably have to listen to se several uh, beats. So welcome back to my channel, I'm counting for real, yes, thanks for joining me. I'm just running through some beats and, you know, the pre preliminary stages of my next, you know, songs. I need, I need about six more songs, but I try to do one at a time. So this was a nice beat right here. Let me see what other kind of beats I have. Let me see what else I have. What else they have on here? Let me see. That was a nice beat. Mhm. Mm that was a nice beat. Uh, let me try. Let me go down. Uh, this is uh. Let me see. Warranty free. Okay. Let me try this one. In my last video, I was uh, just reading some passages from uh, Michelle Obama's book, uh, Becoming. And um, the book is very interesting, so I had it for some time, and I didn't get a chance to read all of it, but I read some of it. But it's uh, very interesting in Becoming. In other words, uh, how many things in life do we have to go through before we actually become who we are? who we are intended to be. A lot of times we are not intended to be just one, you know, particular person. We have so many things that we go through in life before we actually get to the end result. So that's what it is. That's what I guess that is why she named the book Becoming. So no, in other words, what, what things did she have to go through before she became, uh, before she became the first lady? Or, or before she came, uh, the woman that she is today. The same thing with all of us. What what steps did we take in life uh, that led us to the final uh, point, the final result? So, I know I did so many things in life. I went to so many universities. I wanted to be this, you know, change my mind. I wanted to be this. So, first, first, I started out. Uh, wanted to be a um, 
Well, actually, I did nursing, a nursing assistant program. I thought I wanted to be a nurse. So then I went to U, uh, the University of the District of Columbia, um, and I was up there studying nursing. And then I changed my mind on that. And then I, I started, I changed my major to uh, office, office administration. So then my husband was like, oh, honey, you know, you shouldn't be taking office administration. You shouldn't be doing that. You should be doing business administration. So then I changed the business administration. So then after business administration, uh, I finished that. And then I uh, took um, uh, information systems. Then I, went, then I studied information systems at Australia University. So I'm not counting, I don't count like this. I really am not like a beat right here. So let me take this off. So uh, I'm not counting like this. I'm counting like this. Let me take this off. So uh, uh, information systems, uh, uh, business administration, information systems. So uh, I just did so many things. I was, I guess, coming up in life. Something I get just uncertain. You're yeah, just uncertain. So when people say, "Oh, well, you should be uh, a nurse," or "You should be a doctor," "You should be a lawyer," "You should be uh, an administrative assistant," "You should be an accountant." Sometimes we are not set out just to be one particular thing. So sometimes we may go through so many different uh, steps, I guess I would call it, uh, uh, so many different, uh, you know, steps. Of, uh, uh, I guess I would call it steps. Uh, or even points, so many different points in our life before we, so in other words, the book she wrote, uh, it's called Becoming, so... I guess it's becoming who the woman she is today before she became the first lady. In other words, she uh, was from the south side of Chicago. She started out, uh, I mean, she was very, um, you know, they were very family oriented. So she was, she was around her family a lot. And then she started, um, her aunt was teaching her how to play the piano. Well, she said she wanted to learn the piano. So she started out learning the piano. Then she went to kindergarten. And then uh, she was very close to her brother, a brother named Craig. So then her brother was a little more outgoing than she was. So her brother was hanging out, doing things and working And uh, as he got older. And then she uh, was hanging around the house. Uh, as I guess when she was coming up, her mother was like, she was trying to get her to, get, uh, to go out the house a little more and play with her friends in the neighborhood. So I guess eventually she did that. And I didn't get a chance to read the whole book. That was just the beginning. That was just what I took from the beginning of the book. So uh, the book, it seemed like it's a very nice book. I bought it I bought it last year when it first came out. So I'm going to read the rest of it. I'm going to get down with it. I'm going to read the rest of it. So let me see if I can find me another beat. Uh, let's see. Uh, bedroom eyes. Let's try this one again. So that's what, you know, the beginning of the book entails. So the book seems like a very nice book. So let me try this beat. And my work, my song is, baby, 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 you know, you know. So these are royalty free beats. They say you can use them in your songs, you can use them on iTunes, you can use them on YouTube, you can use them and keep 100% of your royalty. So they are called royalty free beats. Royalty free beats. See the beat? I listen to the beat. That beat is pretty good.
Man, he back had to give me some something to snack on. My cottage cheese and my um, sour cream. Throat is dry. Um, let me see if I can pick another beat. This beat by here is called um, Dark Roast. Mm -hmm. 
microphone. fruit in it. to the song, some words I will uh, eliminate, 
got, you know, because I got to make sure that I can sing the particular, you know, I got to make sure I'm picking words that goes with the tone of my voice. See, I don't want to make that mistake of trying to sing, you know, how sometimes, you know, you may try to sing a song that's not even in your range. So I don't want to do that type of, you know. Come back, baby, come back, baby. Uh, let me see. Oh, okay, I gotta hit this one. I hit the wrong button. Uh, let me try this one. Preview the beat. My other song was um, I love you and you love me. It was so wonderful. It was... See, I already think that, that beat right there would be too slow for this song. So this is my podcast, my musical podcast. for that song is cool but this new song I gotta I'm trying to get you know the words finished I'm trying to get I will the, my other song that took me like three days to write that well actually I started it writing it uh uh two weeks I was writing it two weeks and then I stopped and then I said well you know what let me finish and so then it took me three days to finish but I had already started two weeks ago previously See, I would have to sing it slow. Now, I could change the tone. I could say, come back, baby, come back, baby. You know, you know, you love me, love me, baby. See, yeah, it's called bedroom eyes. Come back, baby, come back, baby. Or the beginning of it was like, baby. See, instead of saying it like that, I don't want to say it like that. I can say it like, baby, 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 baby. So I'm thinking about starting it off like, come back, baby, come back, baby, come back. See? Come back, baby, come back, baby. Instead of baby, baby at the beginning. I think it's come back, baby, come back, baby. And I got down here. Oh, you know, you know, you drive me crazy. See, come back, baby, come back, baby. You know, you know, you know, you drive me crazy. Come 
I have to get some more words, put some more words to it. So this is, you know, just something to practice on in my little homemade, home, homemade, uh, you know, home studio. Because if I was in a real studio, you know, somebody else was helping me out, uh, I probably would be there all day. Because you have to keep doing it over and over and over until you get the tone right. Everything I know how it go. So come back, baby, come back, baby. You know, you know, you drive me crazy, Let me see. Smoothish. That's why um let's try this beat right here. It's called smoothish, smoothish. Let me see what it sounds like. Three beats that I owe. Now, that's something I could get with. I love you, love you, love you, baby. I hear always, um... Turns out, wow, you know. Come back, baby, come back, baby. Now, see, that's a nice beat right there. Oh, yeah. Take it in. my other uh some of my other videos uh on my youtube channel um uh, I, I do be talking about uh business accounting uh you know i give two uh county tutorials uh i'm giving business lectures um uh, law i have law lectures that i've been giving on my channel so i want to do so much on my channel i'm just getting started and this beat right here, I'm loving these beats right here. Now I did download some other beats. Um I'm an I'm an unbelievable beats that call, but I'm kinda of liking these beats better right here. These are called free beats that I own. Free beats that I own. Free beats. I'm gonna write that down. Make sure I write that down. That I own. So then the other one is unbelievable. Bees.com. So in other words, on my channel, I'm trying to make it my own. I'm trying to, you know, I see a lot of people's channels on YouTube and they have some very nice channels. So I'm trying to, I'm not trying to compete with nobody, but I'm just trying to be the best I can. And it's something I like doing. I just love doing it. So to me, it's not all about the money. I'm not making any money off my channel. Not right now, anyway, but uh, it's just something I like doing. It's very, it's fun. Mm -hmm. And we're from, um, um, now tomorrow I might go to the store and pick up some fruit and put it in, but it's pretty good. Mm hmm. Cream tea. Uh, I mean, uh, this is a uh, sour cream. 
and right, cream and cheese, sour cream and um, uh, sour cream and uh, what did I say that was? I forgot what it was. Remember I add rice, uh, kidney beans. You know, they put it in the chipotle bowl, but they put fruit in there, sometimes meat, uh, sour cream, kidney beans, corn, and different things like that. It depends on what you want on it. So sometimes I just make it at home with my kidney beans and my rice and put my sour cream in there. And I might put a little corn in there. Uh, okay, let's see. Let me find me another beat. Baby, 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 baby. Come back, baby, come back, baby. So in other words, you have, you in a relationship, you know, Valentine's Day coming up. And your love of your life left you, and then you want to sing to him, call him on the phone, send him a text. Then you say, come back, baby, come back, baby. And then you be like, you know, you know, you know, I love you, love you, baby. So, then, come back, come back, baby, and be my valentine. So, Valentine's Day is in, uh, what, three more days. And, you know, you have flowers, you have candy, chocolate candy, uh, so many things, you know. You know, most, most people give candy, chocolate candy, um, uh, flowers or something like that. Um, so... Some people say they're not big on Valentine's Day. They're not big on, you know, uh, worry about Valentine's Day because a lot of times people, um, you know, they figure, you know, Valentine's Day, when it comes to relationship, Valentine's Day should be every day. Don't just wait till Valentine's Day to give me some flowers. That's the way some people feel. Don't just wait till Valentine's Day to give me some candy, you know, chocolate candy because we all like chocolate, but, you know, we don't want to eat. We don't want to eat chocolate candy every day because it's really there's too too much sweet stuff every day. But every now and then, you know. But you know what? Don't wait to Valentine's. They say, hey, look, give your lady some Valentine's candy and some flowers at least once or twice a month would be cool. Mm-hmm. So uh, let me see if I can pick another beat. Here go a rap, a rap beat. Let me try this beat right here. Baby, 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 come back, come back. Oh, this is a rap beat. Let me see what they're talking about. Rap beat. Let me see what they're saying. It's a royalty free rap beats. Uh, mellow out. Uh, let me see. So these beats right here. Uh, let me see what these beats sound like. But these are some nice beats right here, so I gotta buckle down and get the words finished. And then this one called Mellow Out. Free beats that I owe. Your music on TikTok. I couldn't even put the words on that because that's a little too fast.
Like beat. I can use a beat like this. Now it's a um, I have to, you know, I'll keep on playing until I get the exact beat that I want that match the words that I am going to be. Okay, let me go back. Let me let me go back and see. Oh, we at 37. I got about I got about 20 more minutes. So this is a good time. This is vulnerable. Let me try this one. This is called vulnerable. I love you so. I love you so. So music is the type of thing that you know, you know, makes you feel, you know, you know relaxed. You know, the right type of music can make you relax and just relax and enjoy yourself. Be one within yourself. Sit back and relax. Get you a cup of coffee, a cup of donuts. Um, listen to some good music. Sometimes it's, you know, nothing wrong with being by yourself. See, this beat right here is a little slow, but I can, I can go almost use all of these beats right here, the ones that I listen to. So this is like the fifth one I listen to. So I can almost try to put some words to all of them because I need about six more songs. I did two, so I want to do about six songs and have a whole album. I love you, I love you. I love you so, I love you so. I love you so. See, I will have to sing it. I will have to make it slower. I will have to make a song, you know, with, with the words that's going well, right with the beat. I love you, I love you so. We fell in love, we fell in love. I love you so, I love you so. It said, get these beats right here, uh, free beats, free beats I owe. So that's where I am. I'm on free beats I owe. So let me try, let me find something else. Let me see. I love you so, I love you so. We fell in love. Royalty free rap beats. Uh, So let me see, rap beats, new beats. Oh, they got hip hop beats. Browse our entire, entire royalty free music catalog by John Ray. Uh, free beats IO. Uh, okay, let me see. Electronic beats, East Coast beats, West Coast beats, uh, country beats. Nah, 
use royalty free music to spice up your projects when you're creating content whether it be recording a rap song or soundcloud uh or making a youtube video you want to use high quality music for the backing track uh of course so it says a uh, download and use our free beats download and use our free beats for your Download royalty free beats for your next project. Download and use our free beats uh, for your next project. Oh, this is YouTube. Let me put my glasses on for a minute. I want to make sure. I love you so. I love you so. How can these beats be used? No matter what type of project you're working on, our royalty free music can help enhance your content. You might use it to create a jingle for your brand or your podcast. You can record a rap song and shoot a music video. You can play it as background music in a video blog. I see how everything you you can use these beats for. So yeah, these be what I do. You, you know, you, you want to do some songs. You pick out your you pick out your uh, beat. You know, you pick out your beat for your song, and then you uh you know you are you might, sometimes you already have your song written, but you know you might not. It says the music on our website is available under a under a non-exclusive royalty-free license. Non-exclusive means that you are not the only one who is allowed to use the music that you download. It is a library of music that content creators. Uh, con it is a library of music that content creators from around the globe can use for their projects. Uh, artists shouldn't feel limited by the fact that someone else may have used the song before. If the song is a good fit for your project, use it and don't think twice about it. There are so many different ways to use our music uh, that you're like, unlikely to see someone using it in the same way you do. Remember, we retain 100% ownership of our music. You have a license to use it. The only restriction that we put in place on our Royal to Free Music is YouTube Content ID. You cannot register audio feature in our music with Content ID. So, all right, let me see, uh, browse our entire, entire Warrior G3 music catalog. Click on one of the genres below to find the music that best fits your project. Okay, we got rap beats, we got new beats. Let me try, let me try the new beats. I love you so, I love you so. We fell in love, we fell in love. So let me see, let me try another beat. Uh, Boomer, vulnerable. Let me try Boomer. This has, okay, this is cool. This has got a, a good side behind it. Oh, that's too fast. Yeah, that's too fast. But that's gonna be too fast. Let me try a couple more. Oh, I think I did this one. I did this one. 
I heard him uh, mellow out. Let me show you. I think I, I think I, I think I heard this one too. Mellow out. Yeah, I heard this one. This is Free Beats that I own. Royalty Free Beats. I heard this one before. Let me see if I find. Okay, they finished with this one. Uh, they they are finished. Mm -hmm. So it takes time sometimes. To try to find the right, uh, I'm gonna go. You know what? Maybe I can go back to one of the ones I played before. I think I like. I think I played this one. This might be one of the ones I was kind of liking. Let me, let me play this. Let me see. Yeah, Dream Girl. I played this one, but baby, 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 baby. Come back, baby, come back, baby. In my other song, I've been trying to see if I could, you know, See what it sound like if I would have matched it up with a different beat. But the beat that I picked, it was on the one. I love you so, I love you so. Now, if I would have sung it with this beat, I would have had it uh, sing it a little slower. I love you so, I love you so. We can love, we can love. My new song, well, this is just a preliminary. I don't even know if I'm going to use these words for this song, like I said previously. But it's just something that I'm practicing on. Baby. Together. You and me together, baby. Come back, baby. Come back, baby. So let, let me try this one. It's called Bleak. I ain't want to say the other word. 
But I don't know how this is going to sound, but he looks like he, um, you know, you know how Chucky be scaring people. <laughs> hmm. That's what he was looking like. Now, see, that's a nice guitar, but um, that's a nice beat. But it's a little too fast for what I want. Because I can't sing my song. I ain't never been singing no song that fast. <laughs> really? Really? Mm -mm. I want to do also on my channel some uh, interviews, you know, talking about different topics, you know. Uh, I have my neighbors, I have friends, I have family, relatives. I want to do some round table talk. I want to do some round table talk. So uh, look out for that on my channel. Uh, round table talk. Uh, look out for that probably the next next few weeks, maybe. You know, so once I get everything together, I need to do my research, write down some topics. So you know, I have a certain amount of episodes. Uh, so I won't have the round table talk. I won't have no round table talk on every, uh, you know, every uh, uh, channel, not channel, but every, uh, every channel session, I would say, so I won't be having no round table talk, but I do want to start something like that, that would be nice. And then I want to do some more uh, cooking segments, some more musical segments like this one. Uh, so many things I want to do on my channel, it's just, you know, so exciting to me to have a channel. You know, something that we can do, we don't have to pay. So it, it, and it's just a blessing that you get to express yourself on your channel, talk about yourself. So as I said before, I am um, sure I let Hubbard Walker, Walker is my, maid, my married name. And um, so my husband passed away uh 2018. But he left me with a lot of inspiration because he was a guitar player. He was a fantastic guitar player. So I'm just trying to, uh, we we'll never get over a loss. But what I'm trying to do is just trying to, I guess I would say, uh, you know, succeed. Uh, honor my wishes, honor my dreams and my goals. <clears throat> Cause he was a great inspiration to me when it comes to music. So he helped, he helped our son. Uh, my son plays the uh, keyboard and he raps. So my husband got him into music. And then I had no thought that, I mean, I, I knew I always liked music, but I never thought that I would even write two songs. I wrote two songs, picked the beat for him and singing them. But you know, I'm not no, I'm not trying to be no musical superstar or nothing like that. I'm just following my passion and just doing something just to, you know, for enjoyment. And, you know, I get a kick out of uh, putting, these, uh, putting these videos together for my channel and working on my music and, you know, helping out the family and doing the things that I do. You know, so I, like, like I said earlier, earlier, I went to uh, 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 University of the District of Columbia studying office administration, I, tra I transferred to Strayer University because uh, my husband was telling me, honey, you know, you should be doing business administration. So I went down there, Strayer University, I finished down there in 2001, uh, business administration and um, and my master's, um, my master's, actually I finished the master's 2001, that was uh, uh, information systems, so that's why I always talk about it on my channel. Uh, business because my degree was business and information systems so and then I took accounting I took business I took law classes so I'm just reliving some of the classes that I took and um, you know so you know it's very exciting to me to be able to be on my channel and talk about these things uh, you know a lot of the from the from the courses that I've taken now at Strayer University and uh, I had a lot of nice professors down there. They were very, very enlightening, very, they all, they were always very well prepared for classes and 
uh, treated you with respect, and, and I learned a lot from those professors. I had mostly male professors. Oh, I had a couple of females. I had, I think my uh, computer, a couple of my computer courses, I had female uh, instructors, and then I had, uh, uh, I took a programming course that was from, that was, uh, I think um, I had a male instructor for that. Dr. Jewell, he was a male. He was, most of my business courses I took from him. Uh, him and Professor Bush, he was male. And yeah, so I really enjoyed my time down Strayed University uh, right here in Washington, D.C. So like I said um, in my previous video, um, if I can be an inspiration to anyone, just let me know. If you need any advice, if I can give it to you. Uh, you know, you can always comment down below in, you know, all my videos, down below on the videos, comment if you have any uh, questions that I, you think I can, I mean, I think I may be able to answer. If you have any questions that you need, you know, me to answer, feel free to comment below, subscribe to my channel, and, um, you know, if you can give me some ideas of what I can do on my channel, it would be great. Things that you may want me to talk about, I don't mind talking about it, because I do not mind doing in uh, research. I'll be glad to do research. So I was talking earlier about uh, my previous video, I believe that I did earlier today, about Black History Month. I know we have Valentine's Day that's coming up Friday, so get your loved ones. Some, I mean, it don't have to be your wife or your lady or your girl. It could be your mother or your sister, your aunt, uh, anyone that you want to you you want to get something for for Valentine's Day, show them how much you appreciate them. So you know, love goes around every day, not just on Valentine's Day. So yeah, your mother, your aunts, your sisters, your cousins, your nieces, whoever, whomever you want to get something for Valentine's Day. So I want to say Happy Valentine's Day to uh, all you YouTubers out there, to the whole to the whole world. Blessings to all the fam families. Uh, you know, on Valentine's Day, my family as well as everybody else's. And um, so, uh, like I said, I um, I started down UDC, up UDC first. That's in Washington, D.C. And then I went to Strayer, finished down there. And um, I have, um, you know, I got married. And um, I got married in 2005, had three sons. And um, so I have a whole lot of grandchildren on my husband's husband's side, and then my two of my sons they had one of my sons had a daughter. She's about a one. She's about one and a half, I believe. And uh, my son, other son, his son is uh, eleven. So that's on my side, you know. But on my husband's side, he had a he had a whole lot of grandkids on his side. So. And um, they, you know, I still consider them part of my part of my family, so I love them as well. And so I'm not going to talk too long because it's up to 58 minutes. I usually try to make it about an hour. So I was just working on these beats. So like I said, inspiration, if I could be an inspiration to someone, anyone out there, you know, any of you YouTube, YouTubers, young, you know, young, older, 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 male, female, um, you know, so always feel free to comment uh, below or send me an email. You can reach me at Cheryl, uh, Arlette21 at yahoo.com. That's uh, C-H-E-R-Y-L-E-A-R-L-E-T-T-E-21 at yahoo.com. So feel free to reach me by email. And um, so, um, as I said, I will be trying, I will try to, uh, you know, the title of my, my uh, channel is Accounting for Real, but I'll, I would definitely, definitely be offering more than just accounting. So um, I'm not an accountant. I did take accounting. I took several accounting courses down at Australia University. So. But I do want to, you know, do some other things on my channel, accounting, business, uh, law, you know, different lectures. A lot of times I, you know, and then I want to present some of my, uh, you know, present some of the 
uh, topics and, you know, out of my books, some of the books that I study, you know, that I used to study uh, when I was down, uh, used to study in when I was down at Australia University. So those will be, most of those books will be the ones that I will be presenting uh, for my, um, you know, my lectures. Let me try this. Uh, let me see how, what, how this beat sound. So, resolutions. So this might be the last one. I'm going to wrap it up. Uh, YouTubers, 2020. Baby, I love you, love you, love you, love you, baby. It's okay. Yeah, that's a little too fast. That ain't working for me. See, I don't want, I don't want to say nothing that fast. I, I'm not. You know, I'm not, you know, ready to sing any song that fast. So this one is called Trife, Trife Life. Baby, 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 baby. And you know, you know, you love me, love me, baby. See, my two songs is already finished, and this song, this song is going to be baby. All my songs is about love, and um, Valentine's Day is the best time to sing. Now, this is uh, a nice beat. Oh, baby, baby, baby. Yeah, you know, you know, you know, you love me, baby. And then, uh, see, that's kind of fast, too, so I don't know, <coughs> don't know if I'll be using a beat that fast. I mean, it's a nice beat, but... So, you know, 
but uh, thanks for joining me today. So I'm 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 doing I'm about five minutes over an hour, so I'm gonna stop right here because I don't want them to say my video is too long and they won't be able to upload it. So thanks for joining me today, class, and I'll see you next time, same place, same time, same channel, County for real. And I want to do you know I'll probably be back again tomorrow with another studio session. So I need to do more of these so I can get these words down, get pick this beat, and be done with this song. Be done with this song. I've already started writing it. So I'm going to work on it probably early tomorrow. Work on it. And then get back in the studio right here. And um, get this song finished. Get this album finished because I already did. So I need six more songs. I already did two. So I'm trying to do at least eight put eight on there, you know, so I can just have one CD with eight songs on it. And I would love to do a couple rap songs, put a couple rap songs on there too. If I can, you know, it takes time though when you have to work by yourself. You know, it ain't like I have a writer that can, you know, write write it for me and then have a vocal coach and all that, you know, have everything set up. I would love to have me a nice studio. This is like a this is a studio, but I'm saying I would like to have um you know, another studio where I have uh, another location where I have all, you know, more equipment. Everything that I need, track boards and mic stands and nice mics. You know, this mic right here, so it's all right and get the point across, but, you know, so, but, you know, studio equipment. So, you know, you might have, a, I have amps and all that here, so I, I don't need no amps. So I would like to probably have a, uh, I don't know how many track boards I can have. I know I heard about it. I heard those are good to have too. In other words, then you can, you know, now you can have somebody else working those type of things. But I'm not familiar with none of the things. You know, I know my son has his studio set up in his house, so but I don't think he has a. Uh, I don't think he has a track board. I don't think he had one of those. But um. Okay, so thanks for joining me today, uh, YouTubers, and I'll see you uh, next time, same place, same time, same channel, and uh, I want to say you all have a good one. So I'll see you back in my studio right here tomorrow, same place, same time, same channel, County for real. I'll see you back in the studio tomorrow, all right? Take care. Have a good one.